that excited? Yeah. <laughs> I Don't thought you... I was the one that was more excited than oh, you were. Oh, who can be more excited than bugles? <laughs> Only when they're ranch or salt and vinegar flavor. Oh. <laughs> Do I get excited bugles. over these? You remember these back in the day when they first came out? Yeah, you have tiny fingers, so you put them on all your hands, like oh, a monster. I wonder if they still fit my fingers. I doubt it. Oh, man, we'll find out. All right. The Bugle. The Way. All right, guys. All right, they don't fit my fingers. I could have told you that. Ready? Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Those are fresh. You using guacamole? Guacamole? Mm -hmm. I don't think I've ever put bugles with something. I just want to dip them in some guac. They bugle bar? But... A bugle bar? What? You just have bugles with a bunch of different dips? A bugle bar. Might that be the new thing of 2020 instead of charcuterie boards? It's bugle boards. People put out your three main bugles with a bunch of dips. Bugles will be sold out everywhere. Oh my gosh. What about bugle nachos? We'll call them blachos. No, stop being weird. No, bingo. Okay. Nah. We already learned. They probably go soft. No, when you cook, um, like when you do the Doritos and stuff, we do Doritos with nachos. The flavoring burns. Oh my god. I hate that. Like, it's all still, the good stuff burns off. It's still a pretty good taste, though. I don't but, think so. Well, what's your favorite bugles? You guys oh, ever have bugle God. stories? Bugles will always remind me of like baseball or summertime. You know what I mean? They remind me of other people's houses because we never had them in our house. Oh, so. um, <laughs> going to get the bugles from the other people's houses. Yeah. You have kids that brought these snacks to school. Now, this was an ultimate trade. Oh, God. No one ever had them as snacks. Oh, man. Way. If you had bugles at school, you could trade for, like, two milks, man. You'd be monking around with two chocolate milks. Look at the bubbles. Oh. They're fresh. They're crunchy. <laughs> they're bugles. Put in your mouth and go, do 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 Doesn't work. No. Well, guys. I can't get enough bugles. Ooh, these are fun shaped. I'm giving these guys a thumb up. This is for the perfect scoop of guac right here. But I don't see a single bugle that a kid could put his fingers into like the old school days. I think you're slacking on the manufacturing then. Maybe we just have really small fingers. Why? No fair. <laughs> no. Well. In all fairness, I did hook it to my nail. Not still, hair, so. still, you got the same feeling of bugles from the oh. past. Well, guys. Original uh, and nachos, all they advertise? That's all they have. What the heck? Original, nacho, and ranch. There's no other bugle. Salt and vinegar. There's no salt and vinegar bugles. I've had them before. Really? Yeah. Is there salt and vinegar bugles, people? Let us know. I want to know if there's a salt and vinegar bugle, because I don't think there is. There is. I ate it. You maybe put your own salt and vinegar. Well, I do do that, too. So it could, have, it could have been one of those times. Well, guys. Cheers. Thanks for watching. We're Eat a bugle. Out. Eat a bugle.